Hey everybody, this is Randy Santel. Atlas and I am very, very excited today. I'm going for overall win number 1045. I love breakfast challenges and I'm excited to be back in the great city of Menasha, Wisconsin. We've got lots of people here, which is much appreciated. I am at Weathervane Restaurant. They're open pretty much every day, I think, for breakfast and lunch. But we've got Melanie and then her mother and father, Pat and Julie, they all own Weathervane. I think Pat wanted to be a meteorologist, is how Weathervane kind of got the name, but I'm hoping to become the fifth person to dominate their Tsunami Breakfast Omelet Challenge. Now, there are actually only six eggs as part of the omelet, but there's 14 ingredients total. I'm gonna try to get them all. I know for the meats, we've got ham, we've got sausage, and then we've got bacon. We've got four cheeses in this thing, which is Swiss, American, cheddar, and then pepper jack. And then we've got all kinds of healthy vegetables. I know we've got tomatoes, green peppers, onions. We've got a lot of spinach. And then we've got mushrooms. I love mushrooms. In addition to that, we've got two slices of bread. I went with their most popular sourdough. That is toasted with some butter. And then we've got over a pound of their hash browns along with four giant buttermilk pancakes. So it's like seven and a half pounds total. I've got one hour to finish. If I fail, it's gonna be $30. But if I win, I'll get my entire meal for free. I will get a sweet t-shirt down to my collection and I'll be the fifth person with my name and photo up on the wall of fame here at Weathervane Restaurant. Let's get this challenge started. All right, I am starving and ready to dominate now that I just finished watching the chefs cook all this delicious food. Big thank you again to Melanie, Pat, and Julie, their entire team with Weathervane and Menasha, Wisconsin for having me in. And Katina's gonna be going after me, so we've gotta set a quick time. Four people have won this thing, over 200 people have tried, uh, almost 300 maybe, but only four winners. My friend Molly Schuyler, she's got the record for this, which is just under 12 minutes. We are not gonna try to beat that, but I still wanna do my best and set a quick time. So let's shut up and eat, starting with some of this omelet. One, two, three, boom. All right, and I do have six spoon. And it's all held together by a tortilla, which is pretty cool. More carbs, which is exactly what I need. And I can eat all of this and still call the challenge healthy because I'm gonna be using sugar-free syrup. We're in Wisconsin, lots of cheese in this thing. I don't normally do this, but I'm gonna knock a few of these pancakes out early. I don't think I'm doing this right. Okay, there we go, thank you. All the vegetables in this thing, it's pretty much an egg salad. You can tell there's a little bit of love on those hash browns in the form of butter, and it is yummy. We're not going to, but 30 bucks for all this is pretty a good deal, so even if we lost, it'd be all right. The middle is still hot. Trying to make sure that when I'm done, everybody thinks they could do this challenge themselves. All 
all this steam, I'm starting to sweat. Got the omelet sweats going on. One thing's for sure, this breakfast is amazing. It does not need any ketchup. All right, let's try some of the sourdough toast. Just like that coach's burger last week, I knew this was gonna be big, so I trained Thursday and Friday, and I'm glad that I did. We're gonna get this. Let's have a little breakfast sandwich. Eleven and a half minutes in. Oh yeah, we got some cold Wisconsin water. We're gonna get it. All right, 13 minutes in. We got one slice of toast and then two pancakes. Let's get it. I was legitimately worried about this challenge all week, but ooh, now that I'm here, it all went right down. It was amazing, and we are almost done. Sure to left, no doubt. Nothing but a little bit of sugar-free syrup there. All of that was amazing. So big compliments to everybody here with Weathervane Restaurant in downtown Menasha, Wisconsin. All of that was amazing. I loved that omelet. You know, all those healthy vegetables, the meats, everything was yummy along with those six fresh eggs. And then I uh, enjoyed those four pancakes too. Those were delightful and then I didn't really know which toast I was gonna get, but they said the sourdough is most popular, so I was happy with that. The hash browns, those were amazing too, but ooh, Melanie is bringing me something I did not expect. This is big, what is this? This is the small one? <laughs> oh my gosh. I didn't use actual syrup in this video, and I didn't drink anything but water, so I've saved so many calories. So I'm actually gonna use those to have this cinnamon roll because they're known for these, Oh, let's do this real quick. Molly wasn't able to finish one of these after she got done. Wait, is this buttercream? Is this frosting? What's on here? Cream cheese frosting. Okay, I was not expecting this to be this big, but this is their small. So if you get a big one, good luck. But this has been so amazing, oh, along with everything else.
Ah, all right, so I don't think I said this earlier, but my time, not the new record, but still really happy with it, 16 minutes and 36 seconds. Yeah. Thank you so much, everybody, for coming. Hopefully I inspired you to want to try this challenge, because like I said, that was amazing. But for winning, becoming the fifth winner on their Wall of Fame, I am going to get my $30 breakfast meal for free. Melanie is also getting me my sweet t-shirt, 2X. I appreciate that, because oh, that's what I am. I survived the tsunami challenge here at Weather Vane. Remember, they are here in downtown Menasha, open every day for breakfast and lunch. Hopefully, Katina is gonna be number six. She's going after me. Her video is linked out in the description, but yeah. Thanks everybody here. Great to be back up in Menasha. Katina are gonna be doing its a solo challenge tomorrow, but a 26 inch pizza at Jolly Rogers Pizzeria in New London, Wisconsin tomorrow. But this was overall win, 1,045. Thank you guys for watching.